Hello folks, Jeff Hunt here. Today we're going to be doing a video tutorial on how to create a video email with your TalkFusion account. To begin, you log into your back office. And once you're in the back office, you're going to go to your Video Communication Center homepage. From there, the first menu on the left is for video emails, and the first item that drops down is create a video email. TalkFusion will load the editing page, which includes an area where you can customize the template that just loaded. It will, by default, load your default template uh, that you can save. You will have one when you start, but you can save one as your default template once you've created one that you think you will use most often. Either way, you can change the template at any time. Simply go to the menu list. There are hundreds of templates to choose from. You can pick and choose templates that you've saved. You can do templates that are designed for different purposes. So there's literally hundreds to choose from. Uh, we're going to go back right now for my default template. The banner area, basically an advertising area, you can use one of theirs that are preloaded, or you can upload your own. Uh, it's very easy to change. You simply go to the banner library list, and you pick and choose whichever one you want to use. The color of the frame can be changed. Up here you see the outer frame color. This is the list of colors that you can change that to. Let's say you want it to be red. It's that quick and that easy. The inner frame, which is the one that goes around your video, can modify that as, all, as well. You can change the greeting or the message of the email. The picture, or the logo in this case, can be changed. You just go here change. If you have one that's already there, you select it from a library of saved ones. Let's use this one. And then your personal information. You can modify that. Once you go to the screen where you're going to send the email, that can be modified. As far as the actual video itself, you have four options. You can record from your webcam, import a video from your camera, you can use a saved video that you've done previously and save to your TalkFusion account, and then TalkFusion as well, they have a library full of videos if you're promoting their product. Today we're going to use one of my saved videos. It'll give you a preview of that video to make sure you've got the right one. It'll load it in. And once you're satisfied with everything, you go to send the email. Now, the important part here is you have still one area that you need to be sure that this information is what you want on the email. This is the lower right hand corner of the box that I was showing you. This is where you modify that. So if you want to use a different phone number, a different web page, a different email address, uh, instead of a business name, sometimes I'll put my title there. So you want to make sure the information here is correct before you send it. To key in an individual email address, you would go right here, key the email address, click the envelope here to, to enter it into the box. If you have saved contacts or a large list of contacts, you simply enter those once and save those in your contact list. And let's just say that one of these folders has 10 different email addresses in it. You don't have to key them every time. So just click the folder and they'll all get it. 
Now you want to be sure that you want everyone in that folder to get it because that's the way it's going to be. Below that, you have a subject line, an area for attachments, and a typical text email area that's just like just about any other email program you've ever used. So you can actually put a subject line, attach something to it like a picture or a document, and then a little message to go along with the email describing it. Once you've got that all done, come down to send your video email now. You click that button and the email gets sent to everyone that you've sent it to. It's that easy, folks. It's a very nice, powerful tool. So hope that's helped. That concludes the tutorial for today. Go out there and use your video email.